is back. Last year's festival was canceled because of the pandemic, which had an impact on businesses in Crowley as well. Taylor Tool joins us live from Crowley with a preview of opening night. Taylor. Yeah, Jim, the anticipation here is rising on Crawley's main drag as people are lining up for rides behind me. I'm seeing a lot of happy facers from vendors and visitors alike. As a child, when you pass over that overpass and you see those carnival rides, it is, it, it, you know that that rice festival is right around the corner. From funnel cakes to fresh squeezed lemonade, the 84th annual rice festival is kicking off this weekend. After a year of no festivities, this a smaller window be? That is, that's a small. Local businesses lining the main street eagerly await new customers. With the pandemic, we just no one was able to come in. It was hard for us to get out there and we also supply to different places, not just the public. We were super slow over COVID, but it's about it's almost 2000 shirts that we're going to do for this festival, so it's huge for us. A lot of these businesses are run by locals who have called Crowley home all their lives. But some go out of their way to make the trip for different reasons. John Andre owns Andre's Cajun Cracklins out of Baton Rouge. He tells me he makes the trip in the name of tradition, love for the family business, and for his father. He died three years ago, so I, I want to just keep his tradition up because he's the one that started this. And as some traditions are brought back each year, others change as time goes on. You know, you want to come and then you don't want to come because, you know, the older generation is gone. But, I mean, you have that everywhere. So you just stay positive and do what's right and believe in the Lord. He'll take care of you. And the Festival Coordinating Committee is here telling me that they think there's a plenty of space for people to come out and enjoy as this event stretches over eight or nine blocks. So don't be afraid to come out and have a great time. And the weather should be just nice, as Rob was saying, for this weekend. In Crowley, Taylor Tool, KATC TV3.